Veniero là, fa... o Bounty. Sta fermo là, parcheggiato dopo, sotto al ponte. Sì. Mo? Che scusa? Quando arrivi? Non so, da c'è una banca. Ah, non so. 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 Non No, ci sono venuti a prendere con la macchina per loro. For anywhere between three and six weeks with a minimum of provisions. They were never told exactly how long they were going to stay if they became greedy. troops in the First World or Second World War of Australia and New Zealand through the Battle of El Alamein.
And that basically is the main street of King's Quill encounter, the many accommodation facilities, both backpackers and, and houses. But just coming us is a very famous house in Sydney. It was here where the Constitution was signed. The Constitution is merely the rules and regulations for the working of Australia. It was uh, it came upon in 1901 in a period of federation, the Constitution of Australia, and it was signed by the appointed political leaders in Vaucluse House. Now Vaucluse House is located down to our left hand side. Unfortunately for the most part it is hidden by all of those trees. So if you can't see it at the moment don't despair there are some nice houses here on the right hand side. Some of the people in order to access their properties installed these uh, lifts or flying foxes I guess you'd call them. Usually a one man trolley system that goes up on a conveyor belt. See if I can point them out to you, it's quite uh, interesting. Four Clues House, just down here to our left hand side, through the trees you might be able to see that. It's just a good example of an older style mansion, owned by many success, successive people throughout the years. Many snakes that got into the house. Because of course St Patrick Ritt's island of all, all the snakes. So he figured if he had Irish soil it would keep the snakes out. Just here on the right hand side, I'm not sure if you can see, but under these uh, walkways there's these little uh, elevators taking people in the trolleys straight up to the top of those houses, like an elevator, straight up. Every home should have one. But it means that the harbour itself is very protected. So for that reason it is an excellent harbour and of course as we say deep water. On the southern headland the British Navy uh, first established a garrison here many years ago and the Navy has of course since become the Royal Australian Navy and they have a very large base out here on the base in the headland which is the Naval Training Academy with the Officers Training Academy. And uh, they have possibly one of the best pieces of real estate in the city. We're going to be stopping uh, also just up from the naval base and looking out to the ocean at a point called the Gap. It's appropriately named, it refers to a gap. Both the men and the women. Okay, so it's quite normal for men and women to bathe topless, so don't be too shocked or make a big deal out of it. It's, uh, that's the way it is. It might get a storm later, a few clouds building up. Yeah, it looks like we've got a few people down here at the beach today, and uh, obviously a few absenteeisms from work today. It's quite a gentle surf, so popular for people to take their little children down in the, the water down there. It's called Bondi.
una grande ora. Ma la veglia prima festa, era tutta lasciata qua. Era tutta lasciata la fine del fuoco di un
Смотрите, как он работает. Si piglia bene, lo sai? Non si piglia bene. Eh. Com'è? Qua si vede buono. Bene, si vede bene. Qua si, si vede buono accordo dalla luce. Bello viene questo qua. C'è gettando la luce dentro, c'è spedito. Non si può fare il sito, 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 Sì, 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 sì,
いっぱいいたじゃなさっきグリーンがいっぱいいたわよ